my pre-trip, which I'm going to show you how to do next. So in order to do a pre-trip on here, I'm going to hit my home button, take me back to the main screen. And I got my Zonar logs, my Zonar coach, and my EVIR. And this is your electronic vehicle inspection report. We're going to go ahead and open this. And after we open this, um, we are going to want to start a new inspection. And if you are off duty, it's going to squawk at you and say, and, hey, you should be on duty when doing your inspection. If you're already on duty, it's not going to squawk at you. So I'm actually going to edit my logs and change them to off duty so that I can show you. So let's go ahead and switch to off duty and apply and total vehicle miles. One, two, three, four, five. You want to put in your total vehicle miles and the location. And I'm in Idaho Falls, Idaho. And we're gonna go next and done and save. Oh, uh, annotation is required. So I'm just gonna put off duty because that's what I'm doing right now. And we're gonna click done and save. All right, after the save, we're gonna go ahead and start an EVIR. We're going to start a new inspection. Steve, you should be on duty when inspecting your vehicle. And now it is wanting me to be on duty, which you we DOT does require you to do one on-duty inspection every day. So we're going to go ahead and switch to on. And we are going to do a tractor trailer pre-trip inspection. And after we do that, we're going to go ahead and click continue. And now it's saying use the yellow area as a guide to touch the back of the tablet to the tag and hold it for two seconds. So right now I'm supposed to be scanning the vehicle's asset tag. And that is the black tag located inside your truck. So we're going to go out to the truck and scan that and I'll show you how. All right, now that we are in the truck, you see these little all right now that we are in the truck you see these little yellow tags the two yellow ones and the one black one we're going to go ahead and scan the black one first so what i want to do is on the back side of this tablet i want to match this part up with the black button so when i do that the tablet's going to vibrate in my hand and it's going to be able to recognize the truck so I'm going to hold this here for a second and then it's going to want me to review my last inspection let me see if i can get a spot where i can hold the phone still all right so this shows the last inspection shows that on the last inspection they scan the tractor front right side engine left side engine inside cab compliance tractor left rear tractor right rear trailer front trailer left rear and trailer right rear and everything has a green check mark by it so that means everything is good so we're going to go ahead and click this little box that says we reviewed the last inspection and everything is good then we're going to click continue then we put in the mileage of the truck so we want to look at the truck and put the mileage in which is 223.698 so we're going to put in the mileage of the truck 223.698 continue all right, now, this is everything we have to scan. I'm just going to scan a couple of them, and then I'm going to scan the rest of them off the video so this video doesn't take forever. So, if we need help scanning, we got this scan help button in the top right corner. I'm going to go ahead and click that, because then it shows where the scanner location is. And I'm going to scan one of these yellow tags, and I'm going to scan all the other tags as well. So once I scan this little yellow tag, this is inside the cab. And this shows your cab lighting, steering horn, and if you have any issues with any of these, like, oh, let's just say that I've my door handle broke. So if my door handle broke, I would want to click doors handles, and I want to click broken. Doors handles broken. Is it safe to drive? Uh, yes, it is. And if you want to add a note so it sends it to the shop, um, you could click other 
and we would put something like please fix oops fix this when I get home and then this is going to send a message to our shop guy and once we complete the inspection and it's gonna let him know that we need to fix my broken door handle when we get home and then we're gonna go continue is it safe to drive again um, and if it's safe to drive we select yes and then we save it um, now I'm gonna go through and scan the rest of them now after I've scanned everything there should be a little green check mark on every single one unless we've marked something wrong and in this case I marked inside the cab that I had a door handle broken and after I'm done doing this we're gonna go ahead and select continue in the bottom right corner and then we're gonna certify that this inspection is accurate and then we're gonna submit it all right now you see right there it says upload pending pending please dock the device after we dock the device and drive for a bit, then it's going to send to our shop guy.